good morning, good evening, or good afternoon, folks. Uh, it's Monday, the uh, 13th of uh, June. Lucky for some, unlucky for others. Let's see how the day goes. Before I say any more, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm up at Redditch at the moment, the town centre. The plan is to get the bus to Stratford upon Avon. Um, that's the plan. It's called the X19 or something like that. So that's the plan. Uh, but as the bus came round, I saw the fountain behind and they've took the cover off it. So they have been restoring it up. So I thought I'd give you a few shots of that before I go on my travels for the day. So come and join me. I could do it with a company today. I'm on my own. So it'd be nice to have you come along and join me. So uh, enjoy the ride. <laughs> if I get to the station, if I get the bus, that is. Uh, so uh, I think I've said don't forget to subscribe. I'm trying to get the uh, subscribers up. It's not uh, for the money. A little bit would help. But um, it's uh, YouTube, share the videos more all around the world. Uh, so I would like to get the numbers of you can help me on that. And thanks in advance. Tell your friends, enemies, or whatever. Get them to press that button. All right, pre appreciate that. I ain't got my hat on at the moment. Uh, I could do with an air cut. So that's going to be on the card soon. We're not going to afford it. But <laughs> that's another story. Uh, so let's give you a shot, I've rattled on enough, let's give you a few shots of the um, uh, fountain here before I head to the bus station. See you in a bit folks. Yeah, I've just stood on the bench here to uh, get this shot. So there's shot number one. I might do a little Sony shot as well. So we'll uh, catch you in a sec. Yeah, so I've just got the, uh, um, got it up on the little monopod here, so. <laughs> Folks, I just clambered all up, got my Sony <laughs> to take a picture and got the memory card in it. Uh, it is the 13th, but actually I've got my GoPro with me as well. Uh, but I haven't got, I've got, I could take the memory card out of that, but I'd need a little adapter, which I don't think I've got. So I ain't too worried anyway, I'll just manage with the two cameras. So I'm now heading down uh, to the uh, bus station. So, uh, it's going past the church. Um, I have got a bit of uh, knee ache at the moment. I don't know what's gone wrong, why it started playing up again, but I'm a soldier, I'll be all right. Just a quick pan round here at the town. Just a quick shot on a Monday morning. Yeah, so I'm just walking down Unicorn Hill now. Uh, just heading um, as Weatherspoons there, former Danilo, the cinema from the good old days. There's one thing that's left in Redditch. On my left here, this is where the Unicorn pub used to be. Let's just go all the way round, why not? Uh, yeah, so, so I'm just heading down to the bus station, so we'll see you at the station folks. My well, greetings folks. I'm on the uh, X19. Typical of the bus, it said it was at Stan G. But uh, anyway, we're here now. I'll just give you a little uh, shot round. I, I was going to video the bus whenever I had a chance, but I'll give you a little view now where I am. Join us, 
folks. I do find sometimes I get interference on the, on the bus. I've got me wired mic in. Um, if there's too many people sat by me, I'll just do a voiceover. I'll be the DJ. <laughs> but uh, again, thanks for joining me. It's a ride out. It ain't everyone's cup of tea. But uh, I was lucky enough to get the free bus pass, so why not use it? Can't, don't get much for free today. And uh, talking of free, I've got my hot pot on today. Uh, that's running on solar. I'll let you know later on how that's doing. See you in a bit. Yeah, we're off now, folks. So we're off. That was a bit quick. So, uh, yeah, hopefully. The, uh, just give you a little shot out of that window. Always like that house there. That's the uh, Viola house. It's a lovely house. That. So off we go, folks, now on the X19 to Stratford upon Avon. Hope you enjoy the uh, the trip. Uh, I'll try, I'll, I'll have to sort of. Um, probably cut bits out because I don't want to make the video too long so um, I'm not sure exact the exact route but I do know it's taking a right here which uh, this is um, uh, it used to be the Liberal Club on the left it was the Plough and Arrow I think before this is a new building the Bonham House there that was the Black Horse pub there. I think it's a listed building. We're now going up Mount Pleasant. Uh, it used to be um, you get your fishing tackle on the right. Now it's uh, something else. There's a barber shop still there. Uh, Salop Road, that's where I took my uh, driving test up there in the Mini. Lucky I passed, I got to the top, I was still in third gear and pulled away, still passed. So we got um, the Woodland Cottage on the right, I think that's recently opened up, check it out. Uh, I miss the Montville Hotel, it's called something else now. So yeah, you do get a lovely view up here on top deck. I was recently in Jersey, check the uh, channel out, there's a few videos couple when I was on the bus well uh, they're still going on at the moment the videos but uh, yeah hopefully check those out folks so we're now up at Mount Pleasant Bradley's used to be known as Bradley's garage used to get me petrol from there uh, I'm not sure it's what's just called Mount Pleasant garage now uh, coming up now towards um, the, uh, the park in pub, uh, ready spares, good little shop there for your washing machines, electrical items. Plymouth Road on the right, there used to be a toilet there. <laughs> it's no good telling you now, it's been knocked down for years. So we come up to Edliss Cross. Um, and uh, just going to go over the highway. Now, here, it's the Bromsgrove, all the way there to the right. Swing your back round. Again, thanks for joining us, folks. Um, I'll probably, once we get to the open road, I'll come off for a bit because I said I don't want to make the videos uh, too long. Um, there is an old water tower there on the right, you can just see it up there. Uh, you'll see the new water tower shortly so uh, yeah that's just on the right might be able to see it I see just coming into Edley's Cross now um, this little bit hasn't changed much on the left for many years uh, the right there was houses all there they've all been knocked down um, they do have a uh, Christmas Eve they have a bit of a sing song there it's well worth coming up that's a good night so uh, yeah just at the lights now so join me in a minute yeah we're off now the water tower is on the right there but can't really see it 
The nice chip shop here. Um, the in place been there for many years. So we're at, uh, still coming through Headless Cross. The gate hangs well on the right, and um, the white arm was on the left. Uh, so, uh, and so this pub here, I always forget the name of it. It's called Steps now. It's a very popular uh, little bar there. Check that out. Uh, there was another pub here. Um, Again, I forgot the name, but it's on the right. Uh, that's no longer a pub, it's um, turned into houses. So join me in a minute. Yeah, greetings, folks. I'm doing a few voiceover uh, on this, and I've speeded the uh, video up a bit because uh, otherwise it's going to be too long. This is coming along the Eversham Road, just gone past where Tanner's Croft Garage used to be. Um, yeah, so again, I'm coming along past, I uh, used to live along here actually on Eversham Road many years ago. So now coming in to Crabs Cross, uh, BRT um, are over there, the uh, trophy people. You've got the post office on the right, get your pet nails done over there. Just past the chip shop, and we're coming up to the roundabout now at Crabs Cross. Yeah, it's a bit of a dodgy around about this. Um, you always get people cut you up because you it's, it's it's got markings which are a bit unusual. The lines to a normal roundabout can catch you out. Um, so uh, anyway, we'll see the other side. Well, quickly, that'll take you down towards Oakenshaw there. Hasselbank to the right. Looks like we're going to Studley. Yeah, just a quick shot. We're going down uh, down the slough. Uh, join me a bit further along. Yeah, hi folks. Hope you're enjoying the uh, journey. Don't forget to uh, like and subscribe. Yeah, hi folks. Now just heading into Studley now. Uh, just going to turn left here down Station Road. Yeah, so we've got the uh, railway on the right and it's all gone now but uh, my friend Ray that was over his granddad used to have the scrap yard on the left up there, scrappy ones years ago. So we're coming into Studley so uh, join me a bit further along. Yeah, so just coming uh, into Studley uh, and so I'll try and do uh, if I get people sat next to me, I'll have to do a voiceover on the rest of the journey, but uh, I know I'll get interference. Um, so we're coming up now to the Swan Pub on the right. And that was one of the first Indian uh, restaurants around there. Used to be a chap called Sam and his brother used to run it, there used to be long queues in there at night a bit like Binley Mega Chippy if you know about that uh, that's got queues and used to be the same there years ago to get a curry so Studley's um, doing a lot of building work here at the moment uh, so, so there used to be Studley Exchange on the left there many years ago and uh, I've got the barley mow or barmy cow on the left. So uh, it used to be Studley Garage on the left. It's now Aldi. I used to have a workshop there years ago. And I've uh, got the co-op on the right here. Used to be Greaves' Butchers as well there years ago, different name now. And uh, so we're just going through the centre of Studley. We've got the, uh, the Bell Pub there. Yeah, it's going all right. So join me in a minute, folks. Yeah, hi, folks. Again, I'm going to speed things up a little bit to... Uh, 
try and uh, make the video not too long uh, so I'm going through Studley and uh, let's say on the right used to be the Texaco garage uh, left for Bonky Bearers used to have a motorbike shop uh, there was a pub the Duke of Marlborough that's gone now and uh, so I'm just going through we're passing Erdington's garage in a minute so hi uh, to all the workers there Mikey and the gang uh, I noticed the fuel was about not 190 something a litre there that depressed me but I was on the bus so it weren't too bad because I was getting a free trip uh, to Stratford upon Avon which is great now oh, it's been a, it was a lovely uh, bike Right, right, bus right, get it right, right. Yeah. yeah. You just go up to Spurnal sort of area of Studley now, you've got Spurnal Garage on your on your right and there's a nursery here, a cafe there, Karen's Corner, Brother Alan's a regular there. So we're now heading towards Olcester folks, so uh join me a bit further along yeah greetings folks well I'm still on my own there's plenty of room for company but <laughs> usual thing I'm a loner and we've got coat and court on the left I might be able to give you a little shot of it as we uh, go past let's see whether I can see anything a lot of trees in the way so uh, yeah, so there's Code and Court over there. There is some videos on my channel on Code and Court, so check them out. So uh, and on the left there is the road to Code and Ford. So uh, check that out and join me in a minute, folks. Yeah, hi folks. Uh, yeah, it's lovely ride on the bus and um so we're just uh going past uh coat and court you can just see a bit of it there a lot of trees but uh yeah enjoying the ride out and again as i say, don't forget to subscribe there is a turning left there to coat and forward catch you in a bit yeah greetings folks well we're coming up to king's court motel on the left there uh and there's the rugby club there is a lot of buses they're all the school ones they're um parked up so there's the old sister rugby club there so join me a bit further along folks oh that's the mo's house there forgot about that Yeah, so we've got broad line caravans. It used to be a Renault garage years ago. Uh, it was plans to have a supermarket here, but they've cancelled that. So it's a good shop for all your caravan needs there. So check them out if you're in the area. Coming up to the roundabout now, just outside Olcester. I assume the bus is going to go in into Olcester, so join me shortly. Yeah, so now in, into Olcester, this is the Roebuck pub there on the left, been in there a few times over the years. Just here on the right where that embankment is, uh, a disused railway bridge was suddenly got unearthed recently. I did do a little video on that. So we're now coming into Olcester folks, so join me a bit further along. But, uh, Indian restaurant there, nice food, a bit pricey, but uh, it's nice food. There is a school on the left, so I'm not going to turn towards that, but there is a, a grammar school on the left here at Alcester, so join me at the lights. There's a few folks getting on the bus, I think school kids, so I may be just doing a voiceover now, so just depends where they're sitting. See you in a bit, folks. Right, just going through Old Sester now. Uh, oh, actually, it's turning in School Road. Oh, right, so we'll uh, join me in a bit. Yeah, so just going down School Road. Uh, there's a few school 
kids on the bus, I have informed them I'm doing a bit of video, so it should be alright. Uh, I'm not going to film them, so it should be okay. Uh, Gunnings Bridge on the left. We're going right, I think. And there's, there's the old sister High Street, so I have got a clue where the bus is going now. This is Gunnings Bridge anyway. So not sure where where we're going from here but join me in a bit. Well we're just uh going for the old sister sort of uh, housing estate at the moment. So. St Faith's Road oh, and up this way as well yeah hi folks a uh, few uh, school kids were grown up uh, like college students were on the bus I didn't want to sort of start talking away in front of them so the bus as I say it's the first for me it went uh, through Olcester uh, through like the housing estate I mean, I'd thought about cutting this bit out, but I know a lot of people, they just like to catch a glimpse of somewhere they lived years ago, or their auntie lives there, or whatever. Anyway, that's the Olcester Trades and Labour Club there. Um, when I was younger, we used to go on a coach trip there to uh, the Trades and Labour. They used to have a, um, a disco on a Monday night. So that was uh, pretty good. It's now called the Olcester Inn. So we'll catch it in a Yeah, now we're heading back uh, through Ulster. Now we're not sure which way it's going to go yet, but we'll join us in a bit. Yeah, so we're back on school road, so join us in a bit. Yeah, that used to be Percy Tate's uh, Suzuki garage there years ago. So, so just going into Old Sister, there's the Lord Nelson there, so join us a bit further along. just heading out of Olcester this is the old road that used to before they had the dual carriageways and that you'd go through here um, and this will take us up to the new sort of road going to uh, Stratford upon Pun Avon just along here on the right there is a lane somewhere which will take you to the the Oversley Woods there we've just gone past it so yeah so we're going to take a left now and um, head along the main road to Stratford upon Avon. So I'm doing a voiceover, as I say, because there was a lot of uh, school kids and they were chit-chatting away, it was quite noisy, but they were all right, no problems. Um, so yeah, so I'm going along the main road now. Um, so I hope you're enjoying the video. Um, I'm using, uh, I've got a microphone, I'm not sure where I bought it from, I've got that connected up to the MacBook Pro. I used to just usually use the MacBook mic, but uh, trying it out, I'm always trying different things out. So yeah, so I'm just coming along now, um, I think a bit further along is the turn into Binton, uh, Binton and Binton Club along here. I don't know why I cut that bit, bit out, but anyway, this here, there's a pub on the right called the Stag. Uh, I used to go there years ago, uh, but I'm not really out and about much now. Old git I am, but uh, so I don't go to pubs anyway, but uh, it is a nice pub there. And uh, I, I just love the view. Again, there'll be a few people when I say oh, I've been on the bus to Stratford, they'll say, what a sad life, but it's Obson's choice, and I 
I absolutely loved it. A be you know, beautiful view. So we're now just coming into Stratford upon Avon and uh, that way will take you up towards the M40 Warwick, Leamington etc. And this way will take you into Stratford upon Avon. Now we're along here, I'm not sure if we've come to it that yet, but there used to be a nightclub called Riches along here. Used to go there years ago. Had some really good nights at that nightclub. It was a good night. So, ah, oh, well, the good old days. Uh, yeah, so also, you can see, see the price of the fuel there, depressing. Um, along here, there used to be a, a pub called the Three Witches. That's long gone. It just seems to be a thing when you're talking about places, especially the pubs. Uh, because years ago, before sat navs, we all used to tell people when you want to go anywhere. We'd always say turn right by that pub, go past this pub. But <laughs> them days are gone now. So uh, yeah, it was a it was a good ride on the bus. This was stagecoach. Um, I thought John Wayne was going to be on for a minute when they said it was a stagecoach, but uh, it was very good. I must say, a little bit better than the diamond service i mean in redditch today the diamond service uh seemed to have gone to pot i don't know what was going on but everyone can have their bad days so anyway so we now this is the uh, morrison's roundabout here it was quite busy just here um we're going to go into uh into stratford now it used to be um a market uh place on the left but that's all all gone now um, we got the uh, I think there's some sort of hospital still there so yeah so we just a bit of road work works here and temporary traffic lights and we're just heading in to uh, the town centre not far away from where the bus stops uh, where I'll be ending the video I have mentioned you'll see at the end I went um, to a, a Chinese buffet which was 9.99 that was your starter your main meal and a sweet as much as you could eat which uh, which was great uh, I've had more I did mention uh, I've had my slow cooker on today uh, with the solar panel it's cooked me a massive pot chicken chasser casserole which that will last me about four days and it, it's all charged all cooked on the solar completely free energy which is absolutely brilliant so here we go now we're coming up to the bus stop a first for me bus ride of Stratford and Avon yeah greetings folks welcome to uh, Stratford upon Avon just waiting for the school kids to get off the bus and uh, give you a little shot yeah so that's the bus the uh, X19, we're in a bad little ride, stagecoach, I must say, probably a bit better than the uh, the diamond buses, uh, the inspection going on here, I don't know what, but uh, it's like they're looking at the pavement. Yeah, it was a good ride that. And there she goes. Right. Uh, I think it's time for me to go and have a look in CX. Right by it, about that. Ayo, ayo. Yeah, hi folks. This is just an add in to me bus video. If you do fancy, a, especially if you've got a free bus pass, it's well worth it to come from Redditch to Stratford. A couple of minutes walk from the bus stop, you're at the Chinese. It's near Nando's, it's easy to find and uh, for a tenner all you can eat uh, starter main sweet ice cream everything really tasty food i mean the price of electric and food you can't cook a good meal for that price so well worth you fancy a ride out top tip that is and we'll see in a bit the full video on me meal and that will be on a separate video but if you're coming to Stratford on the bus, I recommend coming to this place behind me. Just here. Kung Fu. 
anyway see you in a bit folks yeah just adding this in before the ending now back in Redditch we're on a slightly different route on the way back but back back okay I've never got to get the 57 or 58 oh right uh, greetings folks uh, now in Stratford I'm going to end this video it's been too long otherwise thanks for joining me as usual don't forget to like and subscribe stay safe and well wherever you are in the world folks appreciate that I might do a little one on my little walk round that'll be on a separate video so see you in a bit folks and let's hope there's peace in Ukraine I say again don't forget to uh, like and subscribe appreciate it hope you've enjoyed the little journey uh, some of it will be a voiceover because there was a few school kids on the on the bus but uh, it was a good ride see you in a bit folks bye for now bye